Hey guys, welcome back to another Animal Crossing video here on Boba Gaming. And if you're new here, hey, I'm Jen, welcome to Boba Gaming. So today's video has been requested by Priscilla, so shout out to you. By the way, if any of you want tips or tricks for Animal Crossing, or you're just not sure how to do a certain thing, let me know in the comments and I will try my best to make a video about it and hopefully I could help you out. So today I'm going to be showing how to customize stalls like I did right here for my boba shop. So of course, the first thing you're going to need is the stalls. So if you have the DIY, then you can go ahead and craft it using the materials that are required, which are just 12 pieces of wood. But if you don't have the DIY, then I suggest you buy one from Nookazon or just steal one from your friend, whichever is easier. Then once you have the stall, come over to Nook's Cranny and go to this little shelf of goodies that they have over here and then just scroll down till you find the customization kits and go ahead and buy some. I'm just gonna buy a bulk. So that gives us five customization kits. Then once you have the customization kits, go over to your crafting table or workbench, which if you don't have one, you can go inside resident services and use this little crafting table that they have inside. So I'm just going to use my crafting table and instead of let's craft, you wanna to go to customize something and then choose the stall to customize. Then this part is all up to you. You can pick whatever color you want the stall to be. And if you wanna use your own design, you can go ahead and click on custom design, which you can also download any design from Able Sisters that you want. You don't necessarily have to make it yourself. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this Nintendo Switch design. And then you just wanna click customize. And there you have it. And then just go ahead and place your stall at your desired location and there you go. And if you're not sure how to download a custom design, then I'll go ahead and show you how to do that. So you just go inside Able Sisters and access this little portal right here, which you can also access by going to the custom designs app on your Nook phone and pressing X, which will immediately take you to the design portal without going inside Able Sisters. But for now, we're just going to use this portal inside the shop. So you just wanna click access the portal and if you want to search for a specific design, then go ahead and click search by design ID. And if you know what specific design you want to download, then you should know the numbers that follow after MO. But if you just kind of want to browse and just see what you want to download, just go to criteria search and then just type in, let's, for example, boba if you want to find a boba design then just insert boba and immediately you will get a lot of boba designs so let's just say you wanted to download this one just click save pick a blank pattern and just click overwrite it then you can go back to your crafting table or workbench and you click on custom design, you will find that the pattern that we just downloaded is there and we can use it. So yeah, that's basically all there is to it. I hope this video was able to help you out and I will see you guys next time. Good luck customizing.